Talka. <laughs> this is the image of our vision and reading. The host of the Rising. Um, Aquarians. <laughs> this is the um, second week in the month of April 2017. And it is the week of the sun. And the week of the sun carries the zodiac energy vibration also at the energy of fire. So this week is going to be a powerful fire week. I love the sun energy. The sun energy is here in this week, which is wonderful. And it is bringing you your focus is going to be the ace of wands. So for a lot of you Aquarians, there is going to be new beginning, cleansing, whatever situation that has been happening in your life in this week. It's going to be extremely good. Uh, favorable new beginnings because one of the four things life experience is going to happen to you. So each and every person look out for surprises from the universe, which is success. And a lot of success, but also new beginnings that are coming in. The sun is bringing wonderful, powerful energies in this week. So for you Aquarians, be aware of new stuff and these are coming in as if the universe and these are two um, powerful energy cards. You have the sun and then you have the, the, the rod which is a spiritual symbol of um, peace going forward in a good way, new beginnings, okay? Remember, this is your focus for the sleep. The sun is wonderful because the sun of the, the energy of the sun comes back in the week. This week begins from the 10th of April until the 16th of April, which is wonderful. It's fantastic. Your week is full net. Um, your best day is going to be Saturday, Monday and Saturday. Um, you have the energy of the Empress, the um, Emperor. Emperor. No, you have the energy of the Ten of Pentacles, the King of the Ten of Pentacles. So this is wonderful energy vibration because a lot of wonderful energies are coming in your life and it's going to be here for a very long time. So we need to express this sort of a thing. On Monday, you have uh, the energy vibration of your, your own energy vibration, which is the energy of the star. And the energy of the star is here on Monday. So expect um, cosmic situation, wonderful situation, um, doors of opportunities open, but yet still your wishes and your dreams are coming true. You are manifesting a um, wonderful experience into your life and this is going to be a powerful experience for each and every person out there. So I expect Monday to be extremely powerful. As we look at Tuesday and have a water day, you'll be connecting with um, Soul Family. So a lot of you will be connecting with soul family and this can be um, um, of, you, of the work floor or in business situation, in relationships, uh, um, friendships and that sort of thing, connecting in a group. But the energy vibration of you connecting with a soul family um, is going to be here in this week, which is going to be extremely good because it's going to help you to vibrate at an, an, an higher energy vibration but yet still help you to heal whatever situation is coming in. On Wednesday, in the middle of the week, you have the King of Pentacles, which is wonderful. You're going to connect with the King of Pentacles. This King of Pentacles person, the universe of Stuart, sent him in your life. And he is a soul. He is connected to the spiritual world. He is a soul family. He is connected on the higher realms, and this is extremely good because um, what is happening is that he's going to come in and um, heal certain aspects of your life, which is going to be wonderful. On Thursday, we have another water energy, so um, the energy of water is in this week for you guys. And on Thursday, you have the energy of the animal. The angman energy comes in because there's a situation that um, you're feeling in limbo. And this situation is as if you're waiting for something. A 
and it's not coming in. And you really um, want this to come in, but it's, it's as if it's taken so long to come in and um, you're not really aware of whatever is going on. And this sort of a situation is something that you need to find and connect with because there's a situation that is happening that you're not seeing clearly. So you're um, in limbo waiting for the answers. On Friday, we have the energy vibration of debt and transformation, which is another uh, energy of uh, uh, water energy that is um, changing you uh, in the emotional situation. And in this coming to something in your life with a, um, a soul connection, an end is coming in your life with a soul connection person. And um, it's as if the karma or the karmatic situation is um, worked out and um, you are moving on to something. Uh, it's not better, it's just that the karmatic situation is over between you and a situation, a person, or um, a relationship, okay? So look at different aspects in your life where this ending is going to be. And it's not about ending, it's just that you've learned a lesson and it's time to move on. As we go to, um, as we go to the energy vibration of uh, um, Saturday, one of your best days because the Nine of Swords is in reverse. Congrats, the Nine of Swords is in reverse. So this is a good, 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 good energy when the Nine of Swords is in reverse. And what is happening here is that the blessings of the, the, the Swords are helping you to vibrate at the high energy vibration. And this is good because this is going to help you to move certain aspects of your life forward. So whatever situation that was there for the Ten of Swords or the Nine of Swords, it's no longer there anymore because this, in this situation is being cleared up now. Okay, you have nothing to worry about but to understand that um, your worries is no longer there. You're dealing with what what's there is happening. For some of you, for some of you people, you'll be um, in the love um, sense. On Sunday, the sun comes back, so this is wonderful. So, the week is the week of the sun, but yet still the sun came out in your energy vibration reading, which is wonderful, and you also had the Ace of Wands, which is um, just fantastic. So, it's a beautiful, beautiful, solid energy, and this is good. So, be aware of what is happening. Understand the process that you're going, understand how you're dealing with this sort of thing, and learn to be aware of this, what is going on, because it's beautiful, it's beautiful. So remember, on Sunday, it's going to be a beautiful day, it's going to be a wonderful day for you, and you're going to feel alive and energetic about your life. As I look at your reading, it's wonderful, it's all about um, the love is um, with people who are connecting with um, uh, the King of Pentacles. If you have someone who is up on uh, Earth energy, the vibration person, there is a situation that you're in limbo with this person. But the sun is going to bring you guidance. The sun is going to bring you to that place where you realize that uh, um, a situation that has been happening in your life is going to um, elevate and bring in new energy vibration, which is going to be extreme. Sorry, extremely wonderful. I'm so sorry. So, what are we supposed to understand from this week? What is the blessing in this week? What is it that is going to affect us? Um, on a spiritual level, but also on the mundane level. It is the energy of uh, the men is going to be 
the men is going to have a wonderful new beginnings. Okay? The men in this week is going to be have a wonderful new beginnings. The men in this week is going to have a wonderful new beginnings. So this is going to be good. This is good. This is going to be wonderful. Um, it's, it's a powerful week because uh, I, I, I'm looking at it as a different aspect because love, the energy vibration, is going to affect the people who are connected with earth element people, okay? The sun, um, there is going to be an end to a situation or the trans uh, the transformation of a situation with a soul member, someone who you know from a past lifetime. And in, in, in Monday, on Monday, Monday is and, and, and Monday and Saturday is the best days in this week. It's going to be one great powerful week. And the men and if you women are looking for a relationship, it's going to be a week of powerful incentive relationship. It's all about relationship, it's all about connecting, it's all about people being in existing um, there's no worries because the sun brings energy over you, so there is not going to be any worries in this week. Be aware, stay focused, understand that sometimes the universe brings wonderful situation in our life, so understand where we are, accept the energies that are working with us in this week because you're going to see wonderful positive things coming out of it. And I'll say namaste until next week.